Okay, so this is number two on creating the transaction, and we're on the same buyer. And if we scroll up here, here's the forms we chose in our first video. And um, our second section is the property information. And so you can click browse right here. And if you have the MLS number or the address, you can pull this up from that. So I'm going to go with um, the address because I didn't pull up an MLS number. And I happen to know... Um, this property by heart um, and I'm going to come down and or right here and say search and it does take a moment and presto magic hopefully it will find our property Okay, so here is the property we're going to write our offer on. I'm going to click over here so that it's highlighted. It turned it pink, and I'm going to say okay. So it's put this information in for me. It did not pop auto populate this. So maybe going that route is not the best route to go, but. Um, you're going to fill out this information, and the more information you put in here, the more you complete your um, your earnest money contract will be. And we're going to skip over all this for now. Um, listing agent, um, if, it, if you're the listing agent, you can click get your profile, and your information will be put in there. And we're going to say that the selling agent is me too, just to save time. And you can fill out all your escrow stuff and all this. Every single piece of information you put in here is going to make completing your document a whole lot easier. So we're going to say, get down to our buyer information, and we're going to say Robert Smith um, and Janet Smith are our buyers and we're going to scroll down really fast to our sellers and say that Joe Jones and oops so Joe Jones and um, Patty Jones are our sellers and then we're just going to simply say save and close and upon save and close all that data is being inputted onto every one of those forms so this does take a moment or two to go through it will say your records created you say okay and it will take you back to this spot our next video will show how to edit each of those documents